Happy Friday guys and gals. It's time for another Friday flow. I want you to do a thought exercise with me for a minute. This might be a little weird, but bear with me. So, tell me, what's the difference between Chinese water torture and taking a shower? Strange thought, right? The difference is autonomy. Let me read you a quick quote. Control leads to compliance. Autonomy leads to engagement. So in our pursuit of, uh, in our pursuit of mastery, it's important that we un understand that it's we. We are responsible for our own destiny in whatever it is that we're trying to master. Um, so let's talk about the essentials, the essentials of autonomy and how these might apply to whatever you're working on, whatever you're trying to become a master of. These, these essentials are task, time, technique, and team. And at every opportunity, I want you to strive to take control of these essentials, to bring your autonomy to the forefront. Uh, autonomy, of course, is the desire to direct our own lives. And autonomy doesn't mean that you're a cowboy that doesn't rely on anyone else. Autonomy means acting with choice. Sometimes that choice is depending on others. That's the team part of our essentials. Now, maybe you're working together with some people to pursue a huge goal. Maybe you're trying to build the next Facebook or better yet, the next life-saving hardware technology. <clears throat> but within that large project, there are individual tasks that need to be completed. And it's your job to take those tasks and embrace your control over those tasks. Spend the time, you decide when you spend the time on those tasks. But if you're really trying to pursue mastery, you know you'll put in the time. And finally, technique. You'll complete those tasks with your own approach. The, the values and the skill sets that you bring to the table. The techniques that work best for you. That's what you bring with autonomy. You bring the best of you.